So now at 11 and streaming on CBS News Bay Area, giving you a live look at San Francisco with the monkeypox vaccine clinic at SF Journal re will reopen tomorrow morning at 8. The city recently received 4,000 fresh doses from the limited federal supply, but for now, it's being offered by appointment to those at the highest risk. The CDC has confirmed 267 California cases, about half of them right here in the Bay Area. But so how contagious is monkeypox and how worried should we be? KPX 5's Katie Nielsen spoke to an expert. The vaccine for monkeypox is similar to smallpox, a disease that was eradicated in 1980. Since then, most people in the U.S. have not been vaccinated and there aren't large supplies of the vaccine. It's terribly important we identify who are the people at high risk for getting this and make sure that they're protected. Dr. John Schwartzberg is an infectious disease expert at UC Berkeley. He says while the majority of current monkeypox cases are being reported in men who have sex with other men, the disease can be spread by any close skin to skin contact, including kissing that lasts for an extended period of time. When I'm out in public doing what I do, I don't even think about it. Unlike COVID, monkeypox is not considered an airborne disease. It's not a worry for people who are going to the grocery store around people sitting on BART next to somebody. Each county in the Bay Area is getting a supply of the vaccine from the federal government. It's then up to each county health department to determine how to distribute it. Here in Santa Clara County today, health officials announced expanded eligibility for high risk individuals. You can find more information on our website, kpix.com. In San Jose, Katie Nielsen, KPIX 5. Tonight, the city of Berkeley announced six probable cases of monkeypox. Solano County also announced its first case.